Ladies and gentlemen, boy, am I in the mood to talk to you. That's right. And I got some information to give to you. We have a volcano in Murapai, Indonesia, that has erupted. And I have been noting, man, the volcanoes and earthquakes have gone silent for like a week and week and a half. You know, while the virus has taken center stage. But today seems like an extra volcano y day. So let me get past all the hard scientific data you came here for, and then I'll just start talking about Romance Valentine's Day, whatever rolls off my mind. Because you can do that when you got a YouTube channel. It's crazy. And now I'm under the impression a lot of people are glad to have me around. Ooh, hey, look, binary pair of brown dwarfs have found. That's, that sounds like a good reason for an edited video. Note to self. So, yeah, we're looking at the Maripai eruption still. Central Java means coffee. It happened in the middle of coffee. Which is probably true. Somebody was drinking coffee somewhere. But, yeah, it's a pretty big eruption, yo. I wonder what's happening in the American volcano range. Papa Catepal. The volcano in Mexico has been the James Brown of volcanoes since the start of 2019. I think it's the hardest working volcano out there. If you didn't know, you do now. Hey, the potential storm for February 20th looks like a dragon swan with a bigger eye in its wing. That's got to be a romantic omen of sorts. And I would guess with Valentine's Day so close, there will be random shots of beautiful women. These are cheerleaders. Um, from the Washington, whatever the name is, of the football team. Boom. It's just you and I watching the public tapel volcano going off. Right now. That's what is happening. And I'm being a bit cheesy with bubble gum. Isn't that great? So yeah, the volcanoes are heating up. And uh, sometimes the shake. Sometimes they explode, sometimes they kick out ash, dust, lava, magma. I guess magma's lava, but magma's lava you don't see. And hey, there's a UFO. Check it out. Everybody knows aliens love volcanoes. But hey, why not? Like if you were just cruising around in a spaceship and were never to allow to talk to any of the humans. You know, if you could be like, hey man, what do you want to go look at now, baby? So we got to take a little break in between all the making out. That's how it works for men. W women can just go nonstop all day for days. At least what I remember. I don't know. I haven't gotten the chance to kiss one in two years. I'm not complaining. The Taylor curse has kept me safe from crazy bitches. And I don't know if you know that. There are crazy bitches out there, man. You know, and a bitch can be a man or a woman. And it can be a female dog. That's the scientific term. What is it talking about? Volcanoes, they're erupting. Kali Yuga, Apalekatakalik News. Talking about Mount Maripai, Jakarta. That sounds like a bad guy. You'd better watch out. Jakarta is coming to get you. Well, I guess it's kind of true. Kali Yuga, Kali. Uh, Shiva and Kali, is that it? No. Shiva and somebody. One's a creator, one's a destroyer. Something like that. You know, like Ender Wigan and Howard Rourke. Yeah, so the Indonesian volcanoes are kicking it. And the Central Amer or South American, where, no, the Mexico American volcanoes are kicking it. And I was talking to you. We got Valentine's Day coming up. What are you wearing? Oh, hey, rapid ice growth. Thanks to the strong polar vortex, the Arctic sea ice reaches the largest early February ice extent in the past 11 years. It, it even exceeds the 2001 to 2010 average size. Well, you know what this means. In the giant media and social media debate between opposition and controlled opposition of corporate climate science, this clearly means it tastes great bro so big win for the taste great team on this singular data point congrats man 
I'm sure there's some less filling people out there like, no way, man, that doesn't prove anything. Ooh, it's going to get cold. Yep, for Valentine's Day. Who would have guessed it? You know, it would save humanity, rock and roll, comedy, and romance. So I figure we got about a week, two weeks, three weeks at best of the power couples to come together and hook up, you know, before America takes a stay-home lockdown mentality for whatever reasons that are going to occur during March. You know, so if you have, if your intuition is telling you that you may find someone that you would super click with that would make life more enjoyable because life is hard. So it'd be great to go through it with someone who will always be there for you and is um ha super cute and just makes you smile by knowing they're in the same room. It's possible. I've seen it happen. I mean, it, you know, you got a better chance of getting a lottery ticket, sure, that wins, but this is worth way more. So, yeah, a little love in your heart. So, take a chance, you know. There's never been a better time now than now that take a chance on love. Because more happy people would leads to more happy people. It is definitely extra enjoyable to make out in the middle of a storm. You know, when you guys are inside safe and warm, but you can hear all the activity outside. All right. So, yeah, sure. 2020, it's super dangerous, man. And all this doom and gloom is like an aphrodisiac. Um, so, hook up smartly. No, don't superhero hook up. Uh, no, hookups is a stupid term. I like dating. Dating is great. All right, whatever. I'm off the rails. Have a great night. I'll probably be talking to you guys regularly this evening because I just have that like weird. Either I want to talk to you or somebody wants to hear me talk to you. I don't know. All right. I love you guys. God bless everyone. Stay cool. Peace out.